Surprise in Fremont tonight. We've uncovered the chicken processing plant that Costco will build off Highway 275 is way bigger than originally planned. Reporter Nick Starling went digging for answers tonight. It's a story you'll see only on three. Craig, this new plan from Costco increases the size and scope of the project. The city says they're very excited about this. However, those that have been opposed from this project since the beginning are not so happy. We're getting an exclusive first look into what the updated Costco chicken processing plant will look like. The hatchery here, the processing plant here, the feed mill here. Costco gave these designs to the city just days ago. The planning board accepted Monday night. You know, it's all good news, so we're really tickled to have them. But this isn't the initial plan Costco proposed. Here's what they updated. The processing plant expands from 250,000 to 360,000 square feet. Investment in the project skyrockets from 180 million to 275 million dollars. And usage of water, sewer, electric and gas will increase. It's more investment, so eventually we're going to see that in property taxes. Interim City Administrator Brian Newton says many major projects do this as the company fine-tunes its designs. It's routine. We have this often on most plans. They will come back and typically revise it. The plant will be placed just southeast of town on over 400 acres, currently farmland. The city faces a lawsuit claiming they illegally annexed that land, designating it blighted and substandard. Randy Rupert's been opposed to the plant from the get-go, mostly for environmental reasons. He's disappointed by the expansion. We are not surprised. Uh, this is the playbook that uh, most of these processing plants um, use. Rupert says this latest move from Costco is just the beginning. They will continue to expand. They will keep asking for more TIF money. They'll keep asking for more annexation. So the next step in this project is that the Fremont City Council will take a look at this and vote on it December 27th next Tuesday. And if all goes according to plan, Costco hopes to start building the plant in the spring. Reporting in Fremont, Nick Starling, KMTV Action 3 News.